Hey, LMMS. Before we begin your school news, let's head on over to your pledge. Good morning, Alma Mess. I'm Paisley, and this is your school news update for today. Today is day one, Wednesday, February 7th, and these are your student announcements. Here are some synonyms you may recognize for the character strength of social intelligence. Understanding, insightful, sympathetic, and aware. The Multicultural Club meets tomorrow after school. If you'd like to join, register with Senora Mascara in room 604. Students who received night of show work forms for the spring musical crew are reminded that these are due next Friday. The earlier, the better. Our PTO is having a Wawa fundraiser for school activities. See our school's website for more info. Drop off books for the IR Student Council Cops and Kids Literacy Program in our main office. Like cookies? See our website for more info regarding our school's Mrs. Fields fundraiser. That's all for me, now let's head on over to your world news. Good morning, LMS. It's Abby here with your world news for the day. Recently, scientists have shown that tomato juice can kill certain bacteria that causes typhoid fever, as well as other bacterial diseases that can harm people's digestive systems. Good News Network says, quote, Salmonella is a human-specific pathogen on often transmitted in food that not only causes all the symptoms of food poisoning, but the potential deadly typhoid fever, which, even after decades of medical advancement, is still a major worldwide public health concern, end quote. So, LMS, do you like tomatoes? That's all for me, and now on over to your weather news. Hi guys, it's Samantha here with Rivers Wednesday weather. Today it will be clear with some clouds with a high of 45 and a low of 26. Tomorrow it will be cloudy with a high of 48 and a low of 27. The job for today is what did you call a snowman in the summer? A powder. See you next week. Bye. Hey, LMS. It's Tula here with your sports news for today. A middle school girls wrestling team had a wrestling meet against Upper Perk over the weekend. Emmaus was down by five going into the last match, but we got the pin to give us the win by one point. It was an exciting match that came down to the wire. Peyton Schneck, Cecilia Lower, and Kiki Acevedo all got pins for the team. Another middle school wrestler of our school wrestled in a national tournament. Brady Schneck went undefeated in the Wildwood National Wrestling Tournament. He was given the Outstanding Wrestler gold medal for going undefeated with a record of 9-0. to zero. He beat the New England State Champion on his way to a perfect score. That's all for me. Now on to entertainment news. Good morning, LMMS. It's Ella here with your entertainment news for today. Today, we are going to take a look at some of the Grammy winners from the 2024 Grammys. The winner for Best Pop Album was Midnight by Taylor Swift. The Best New Artist was Victoria Monet. The Best Song was What Was I Made For by Billie Eilish. The Best Performance Group was Ghost in the Machine by SZA and Phoebe Bridges. The Best Music Video was I'm Only Sleeping by The Beatles. And the best metal performance was 72 Seasons by Metallica. So, LMMS, what do you think about these winners? Now on to your bit of the day. Hey, you want to hear a joke? Sure. How much wood would a woodchuck chuck? 
If a woodchuck could chuck wood. I don't know. A woodchuck would chuck as much wood as a woodchuck could chuck. If a woodchuck could chuck wood. Hey, did you, did you hear about the kid that passed out after they heard a joke? Yeah, I heard that weird guy in the blue mask told her a joke, and then he hit her on the head when she didn't get it right. <gasps> hey! Is that- Wanna hear a joke? We should run! <laughs> Buzz TV. Have a great rest of your day, LMMS.